Hello everybody, and welcome to a tutorial on how to make a Minecraft server. Okay, so in this tutorial, I will show you guys on how to set up a server really easy, um, and also there is no port forwarding required. Um, in this tutorial, I'll show you guys on how to set it up, because some people, they cannot port forward because the router does not let them so this is a very easy tutorial possibly the best on YouTube hopefully so let's go ahead and get started the first thing you guys are going to want to do is open up your browser and go to minecraft.net slash download once you're on there look for the multiplayer server and click on minecraft underscore server 1.7.4.exe or whatever version is shown and click on it and then it should download while it's downloading minimize your browser and right click anywhere on the desktop. Hover over new and click on folder. From this point you're going to name your folder Minecraft server and hit enter. Now you're going to go ahead and click on start and click computer. Go into your downloads folder and drag your Minecraft server into the folder like that. So you should see what you just downloaded is on the folder. Double click on it and click run. And now you guys are going to see this. For some weird reason, my logs are not showing. Um, this could happen to you, but most of the time, the logs do show right here. So, if yours does not show, don't worry. But wait about 20 seconds while you, when you open this first. So once you first open this, wait about 20 to 30 seconds. And then, you guys are going to type in a command. This command is called stop. So, type in stop, and wait about 5 more seconds, and then hit enter. This will save all the chunks and stop the server. Once you've got that done, what you guys also got to know is um, you're going to see a folder called world. Uh, that's a default Minecraft that's randomly generated. If you wish to drag your own uh, Minecraft worlds in there, all you got to do is drag your map into the folder and it should work. And that way you can do what you want. Now you're going to see a thing called server, the properties file. So you're going to have to open it with notepad and click OK. Once you've managed to open the server properties with notepad, you guys will see a bunch of text here. The first thing you want to do is change your online mode from true to false. And that's about it. Now the reason you want to do this is because if your friends have a cracked Minecraft, they cannot join if it's true. So you have to change it to false for your friends to join. It is very very important. Keep that in mind. Next, we're going to need a server IP for this. So. To grab the server IP, what you guys gotta do is go into your command prompt to look for it. So I'll go to start, type in run, click run, go to CMD, and you guys are gonna go ahead and click OK. If you're on Windows 8, hit the Windows R key, and there you go. CMD and click OK. Now you're gonna type in IP config and hit enter. Now you guys should see your IPv4 address. You gotta copy your IPv4 uh, address. Do not copy mine. Copy the one that is shown on your command prompt. And put the digits on the server IP. Just like that. All you gotta do. Now, what you guys gotta do next is on the server port, the 25565 number, uh, right click on it and click on copy. We're gonna need that for later. Then click file and click save. Make sure you save your server properties. You can go ahead and close that and minimize this. Next, open up your browser and open a new tab and go to uTorrent. For this part, we're going to need to download uTorrent uh, to put in the port in. So I'm going to show you guys what to do. Go to uTorrent, click on get uTorrent. And then click on free download. And it should download. Once it's done downloading, go ahead and click on Utor and click on Run. And wait a several seconds for this to show up. Alright, so go ahead and click on Next. Next again. I agree. Next. Next. And right here, untick Yes, I'd love to check this free download. Make sure you don't check that. Decline any other offers you see here. Make sure you decline every single thing. Now, once you've got that done, you guys are going to click on Options, 
on uTorrent and click Preferences. Then you're going to click on Connection and you'll see a port number here. Go ahead and delete that. So you can go ahead and delete this and paste it there, the 25565. Paste that port number in there. Make sure you click Apply and then OK. And now you're done. So go ahead and open up your Minecraft server folder and run the server. And now it should work. So go ahead and close that, but we're not done yet. We're going to go ahead and minimize that. Do not close your server, make sure you minimize it. If you close it, the server will stop. So open up your Minecraft, and then you guys are going to go ahead and click on play. Alright, now click on multiplayer and add server. As you guys can see, my server is already there. I'm going to delete that. So go ahead and click on add server. And you're going to see the server address. You're going to need to put your IP address. So open up another tab. And this time type in what is my IP address. And on Google, you should see your IP address. Your public IP address is the following numbers. This is the address you have to give your friends if you want them to join and for yourself too. So share this address with your friends if they if you want them to join your server. So paste your IP address on there and click done. And as you can see it's green 0 out of 20 and join server. And that's about it guys. That was an easy tutorial for you guys. Um, I really hope it helped. Make sure to click the subscribe button and check out my top 5 Minecraft resource pack video.